What's going on guys? Super excited to bring out this video today because we're going to be installing some recon tail lights on the Trail Boss and it is going to make this thing look so much better. We come up here, you know, we got the black wheels. We're going for the whole blacked out theme, right? Of course. So we got the side marker tint, we got the blacked out front end. You know, the Trail Boss is looking pretty mean, the whole Stormtrooper look, right? Well, we come back here and of course we got the not terrible, but pretty red factory tail lights and we're obviously gonna be making a huge, huge upgrade today, and I could not be any more excited. So let's go ahead and throw the camera up and unbox these beauties. So we went with the smoked, I mean, just look at that. I'm sure y'all can see it. Dude, that is gonna be insane. We got a little swag pack. Let's go ahead and pop this open, see what we got. Sticker, another sticker, koozie. Got a shish, oh, that's pretty dirty looking. Recon shirt, heck yeah, that's freaking sick. Oh my gosh, dude, it's gonna look so good. Let's get it out of this wrapper. Ooh, hoo -hoo. <laughs> dude, that smoked out is so good looking. So they do make the clear lens one as well, but I just prefer that smoked out look. And obviously that's what we're going for, the whole blacked out Stormtrooper look. Two T10 torque screws. It's basically the only thing holding the tail light in. So it might make some terrible popping noises when you go to pull it out, but you're gonna go straight back, straight back. You just wanna kinda of get your fingers in here behind it. Pop it. That one actually came out pretty simple. And then when you get it back this far, you gotta look right in here. So once you get the tail light pulled out a little bit, your harness is actually in a little clip back there. Hopefully y'all can see it. You're gonna to have to kind of wedge your hand in here, pop that harness out of the clip right here in order to be able to take off all your connections. Pretty simple after that. Your reverse light, just screw it, pop it out. Then you got this guy down here, a little red tab. Just kinda wanna pop that guy back. It can be a little bit of a booger. Pop him back, squeeze down, off she comes. A little side by side, new versus old. Not even comparable, dude. This one's like glass and this one's kind of ugly. So let's go ahead and throw this bad boy in there. So your new tail lights are gonna have their own harness. So you gotta remove yours. You got two plugs, one, two, and one goes down underneath here. I'll show you all that. The other one is for your bed lights right here. And I've already taken it off and I'm gonna show you all. So it's the same thing, kind of a booger um, with a red tab pushed in. Um, I found, because it's like this, it's not very easy to get to. I took a little Allen wrench, put it right in here, snuck it up in there, hooked it onto the red, popped it, get you a flathead, press it up against here, and then that comes straight off. Under here, there's our harness coming down, comes over to right here. So pop your black or the red piece and then undo it. And now we're just gonna pull this line out and then we'll toss our new one down in here, clip it up out of the way, plug it in here, plug our other one up into the bed right here, and then we can go ahead and slap them in there. Got the harness out and then these little guys you can reuse. Uh, you can reach in behind them and you just wanna squeeze this and then they'll pull straight through underneath the truck. And then you just get you a flat head and you can pry it right here, pop them open. And then we can put these on our new harness to keep it up out of the way these little covers off so they can line up in there. We're gonna take our harness, fish it down under the truck. We'll hook it up in a minute. I'm gonna go ahead and take this guy, plug it into our bed lights. A little tight. I'm gonna take our little Allen key once again, lock it in. So then now, you just wanna be mindful of your wires. Get that harness all the way down. And you get everything out of the way. You don't wanna snag any, just line it up. You got a screw there and a screw down here. Make sure your wires are free. 
and lock her in, dude. Oh my gosh. I didn't even turn it on and that looks freaking amazing. All right, so you see our harness hanging down here. We're gonna go back, get those clips we took off the original and run it back the exact same way that it was up here and plug it in. As you see, we got our new harness down here, wrapped around, reusing those same clips and hooked up. Let's see if it works. All right, moment of truth, let's see. Oh yeah, we work. All right, before we test out all the features, we're gonna go ahead and throw the other one in and then we're gonna do a full reveal. But just real quick, let's just get a little, oh, oh. And it match, look, look how good it matches. Like this one's almost tinted from the factory. They do make a third brake light, which we're probably gonna get as well. But just, oh my gosh, so good, I'm so excited. So essentially the exact same process here. We do still have to throw these screws in right here to lock this headlight in, but other than that, we're done. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw those screws in here. We're gonna get to this one the exact same way, except for this harness is a little bit longer. I'll show you all that. All right, passenger side, very similar. Just runs across and then comes up right there. So just run it the same way, use your little clips and you should be good to go. And look at that. So I just got done wrapping it up and turned them on and holy crap, guys. This is definitely one of my favorite mods I've ever done because it looks absolutely insane. Definitely the best taillights you can do on these trucks period every single angle looks absolutely insane we're also kind of running out of daylight right now so it's it's honestly about perfect lighting to show you all these so let's go ahead and get a little montage going and check it out absolutely in love with this thing dude it literally transformed the rear of this truck and going from the pretty boring stock tail lights to these is just huge i mean not only i mean i would be happy just for some smoke tail lights but much less with this cool design and i haven't tested out the brake lights or the reverse lights yet we'll do that in just a second but dude it is so unique looking it is murdered out it is just everything about this set of taillights is just perfection like it from the side it looks freaking amazing because it's going with the whole stormtrooper look uh, i don't know how well it looks on camera it kind of looks orange on my camera but it is very very red it is very pure red it's not orange at all i think the leds are kind of messing with the gopro or maybe it's just the screen on my gopro that i'm looking through this looks insane and it's gonna look even better we delete all the chrome off the truck finish off the stormtrooper look but even like, dude, you could put these on a bone stock truck and thoroughly enjoy them. Like, and these, this isn't just for Trail Boss. This is for any Silverado 19 to 21. And they make these for the LED and halogen taillights. So if you don't have LED ones, you can totally still get these. You just got to get the right ones off their website, which link in the description to get these. And hopefully I should have some discount codes for them as well. Probably my favorite thing I've done to the Trail Boss. And that says a lot because Putting the wheels and tires on there was huge. The exhaust, thoroughly love it. Everything I've done to the Trail Boss is just wrapping up beautifully. Oh, they turned off. Oh, okay. Well, perfect. I had them on automatic. After a certain amount of time, they turn off. Dude, oh my gosh. I'm loving it. I'm I'm just, it's another one of those videos where I'm just here at the end, just rambling like crazy because I'm so freaking excited. All right, so that's about enough rambling out of me. I'm going to go ahead and throw y'all up on the iPhone. We're going to check out the reverse lights and the brake lights, finish this video off. So with that being said, hopefully you did enjoy. I'll see y'all in the next one.
already know we had to throw the stickers up on the brow. Get lit, recon. Got the other one over there. Throw our koozie up on our shifter. Let's go.